We're comparing two excellent places in the food today. We've got the Halal guys. And we've got the chicken and rice guys. Basically the same type of food. And I really want to see what the differences were. I had friends in the house and they tested uh, and tasted the food. And um, well, basically both are very good. Yeah. Mmm. 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 Mm -hmm. That was good food. That bread, I love that bread. Oh my God, that bread. That is good bread. I usually get extra bread. But today I got two kinds of bread. The sauce, for them. The hot sauce, haha, <laughs> dangerous. It's a dangerous journey with that hot sauce. Green sauce, excellent. Something different. Different flavors, different places. Same idea. But uh, you can't go wrong either way. Check it out. However, however, one of my daughters preferred the rice from the chicken and rice guys. The other daughter preferred the rice from the halal guys. And um, I don't have a complaint, but the meat from, the meat is cut very thin like that, and it almost looks processed from the chicken and rice guys. It's, you know, it, it tastes fine. Oh. If you've never had halal guys, then you wouldn't know if you if you had the chicken and rice guys. You would know if you went to halal that the meat is more. It's more um, ground up from larger pieces, or you know, they cook it on the on the spit and carve it off, and uh, I, I don't know what authentic would be but it seems more homemade put it that way um same with the rice the rice from uh halal guys seems to be more um flavorful mixed in with the food and the chicken and rice guys the the rice tastes like uh you know something you you get yourself uh flavored rice at uh at the supermarket or you know it doesn't taste like uh, anything different than uh, you know that you'd go far to to pick up and get so with that in mind i'm still eating and i was feeding everybody i'm gonna show you know they have their own they have their own look at that see And I have mine. So the family was divided on the rice. The halal guys we know, known for their excellent meats, halal beef, 
chicken. Of course, Middle Eastern bread, excellent. And the chicken and rice, guys. The chicken and rice. And they also have beef. Get a nice white sauce with each one. You also come with a hot sauce. And they come with the green sauce. Mean green machine. Try the green. Well, that was a crossover because the green's from uh, chicken and rice guys. Want to misrepresent myself in any way? Give it to you the way it is. Man on the street. Man in his yard. Man eating really good food. So I'll tell you, when it's all said and done, both are excellent meals. Love them. Terrific. However, for freshness and overall, overall, uh, sort of restaurant experience. You know, like when you go to a place in a restaurant, you can't just go home and make it. Um, the halal guys, a special trip. Um, chicken and rice, uh, like I said, the rice uh, tastes like something, you know, a package, whatever. And uh, the meat, uh, very good, but looks like it might be uh, processed or, or whatever. They both do a good job. And I'll tell you. If they had a little food truck, <laughs> that'd be the way to go. Every little food truck, pull up, and everybody eats good. And I know they're doing that in different places. So from Bruiser Costa, Alaska Man, and everybody here in New Hampshire, we're tasting the world. Excellent food, good times. Come on out. Woo! Enjoy the food. Hey, don't forget to go to Spotify where you can get Bump Your Rump, Free My People, and all the big hits of the lobster, man. And you can listen to that while you're enjoying your food in Boston. Excellent stuff. So, folks, that's a big thumbs up for Halal Guys. And it's, uh, it's, uh, we'll call that a, a medium thumb for chicken and rice, guys. That's not a bad thing. Both good food. Really enjoyed it. We'll see you next time. Subscribe. Check out Spotify. The Lobster Man. The Bruiser Costa. We'll see ya. Stay tuned. Subscribe to these videos. And you'll enjoy yourselves. So I'll pop up on your screen every day. And you'll like it a lot. Rosa Costa, out here in the pouring rain. No, I'm just kidding. It's not pouring. And um, on one of our, hopefully, many more food adventures. We'll see you next time. Subscribe. Say hello. Tell us who you might want to match up with in a food main event. We'll see you next time. Boom. Here comes the guy with the van. Here comes the guy with the van delivering. Whoa. Boom, boom, boom. Here come the food guys. So when you see us coming, we'll be checking out your food and see if you're up to the food challenge.